While we were away, Justin Kidd, the 33-year-old walk-on and Mount Midoriyama rookie, got his feet wet on the Vegas course this year, figuratively, and on the silk slider, literally. Wow, to make it all the way to Vegas finals and be disqualified because I got my feet wet? Slider, literally. literally. I remember it like it was yesterday. Here's a fun fact for you. In addition to being a hardware engineer, I sewed the shirt I wore at Midoriyama. In fact, after returning from Vegas, I kind of developed a bit of a sewing habit. It got to the point where I started sewing more than training. I even became a regular at the local Waldorf fabric shops. Everyone was doing salmon ladders and warped walls, but me, I was dropping shirts faster than ninjas on last season's jumping spider. I didn't think it was much of a problem, until I started putting on weight, that is. 5, 10, 20. Before I knew it, I put on 40 pounds. Even still, all I wanted to do was make another shirt. I went back to watch seasons 5 and 6 of A&W and gained a new aspiration. Part of my motivation to compete is to qualify for Team USA so I can help the team look more like our nation. I want to inspire folks of all ethnic groups to embrace the culture that is Ninja Warrior and unleash their inner ninja. I started training hard again and was able to take off the extra weight. While waiting for days in Miami and Denver's walk-up lines, I focused my energy into blazing through the qualifying course, and I ended up setting one of the top qualifying times in Denver. I also got the second fastest non-finisher time for Denver Regional Finals. Be on the lookout, as I intend to move just as fast, if not faster, this coming season. With sewing machine out of hand, I'm ready to take on the Doriyama once again and become one of, if not the first, American Ninja Warrior. Except this time, hopefully without getting my feet wet.